How's it going everyone? This is Sean here from Scale Model Car Guy channel and today's video is going to be a mail call, a Christmas card shout out. I know it's late but I got it late <laughs> and uh, yeah. All right, let me get this before I get this started. Thank you, my subscriber. Thumbs up, thumbs down, whatever makes your world go around, guys. If it wasn't for y'all, this little redneck from Arkansas would not have a channel. Subscribing is free. Free, 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 free. We'll never ask you for a thing, guys. Never. All right, we love you. And hope everybody out there, all my subscribers and everybody had a Merry Christmas, and hopefully you'll have a Happy New Year. Um, all right, let's get this started. Uh, yeah, I got a, a, <laughs> a Christmas card the day after, or not, well, we'll see, what was it? Yeah, it was, uh, yeah, it was the day after Christmas. Old Rick from Down the Throat Mallin, buddy. Thank you very much for the kind words, and thank you for the Christmas card and thinking of me. Uh, awesome i love it look at old santa claus there building models he built a, a boat and an airplane and cars oh man that's 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 awesome right there thank you very much appreciate you brother thank you rick and uh, if y'all don't know rick his description will be below he is a floridian living down in florida and uh living the high life all right We'll have a description for him down below. So, uh, yeah, go check him out. Thank you very much, Rick. Merry Christmas, brother. And then, I got this in the mail. That was Douglas Model Garage. He sent me his special shop card of all his small-scale builds. And, yeah, the small-scale group build is fixing to come up, guys, February. Uh, yeah. So there will probably uh, be something on that coming here real soon. So, But yeah, y'all go check old Douglas out. He's a great guy. He's been around for a long time. Go help him out, him and Rick both. Uh, get their subs up. Give them a like, share, subscribe. Just go support them. And uh, they will be in the uh, description below. Thank you, brother. Merry Christmas to you too. All right, now this here real quick uh the other day that last video i did i got a uh, bunch of models in from john over in england oh uh at uh jb scale creations used to be the scale reviver my brother from england he uh he sent me this with all that and i forgot to uh show it and this is a v8 rover engine this is from wheels die cast uh our southeastern die cast who owns it now uh, fine cast uh, but it is a metal white metal 124 scale rover v8 engine and this is for well a lot of british cars that had v8s would have had this but this is for the mgb gt uh that i'm going to build eventually which i got a bunch of them but this will go on that it will it could also go into a morgan uh uh you know the morgan british uh two-seat uh, roadster car the morgan plus eight uh but it, you know it goes in all kinds of vehicles but yeah thank you very much john and y'all get over there and he's so close to a thousand get over there and help him get over that hump he's just about there get him up there uh thank you very much again john appreciate you love you and then this one right here i'm gonna say this is gonna be my next project before i even do this one right here so this right here, y'all remember uh, Stephen Baker? He had sent me a box full of uh, models. I mean, it was like seven or eight models he sent me. And he asked me if I want them. He was cleaning out. And uh, I said, well, yeah, send them to me. And uh, this one here is the AMT 1957 Chevy Bel Air. And uh, this is like the Pro Shop or whatever series, uh, car, car Culture Series. That's what it is. And uh, that is going to be probably what I'm starting next before the motorcycle group build uh, starts and uh, before I get into it. So that will be what I'm going to do. And that's the uh, the 57. It's got the trunk opens. It's got the uh, it's got the uh, photo etched uh, grill and parts. 
And it comes with chrome foil and it even comes with ignition wires. That is a great kit. If y'all ever get a chance to get one, get out there and get you one. But like I said, that is the next project. Thank you, Stephen Baker. I'm I'm finally going to get around to getting to this, brother. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let's get that out of the way. All right. Now then, let me kind of adjust this camera around here, guys. Uh, we're going to open this up. This is a very special gift I got. And this right here is from Dutch over at Assembly Required. And I'm going to leave a link to everybody, Steve and Dutch, uh, Rick and John and Doug. I'm going to leave a link for everybody in the description below. Now, uh, uh, Dutch reached out to me and said, I want to send you something. So, okay, I give you my address and everything. And uh, here we go. We're going to open this bad boy up and see what it is. All right, let's check it out, guys. Oh, yes, looky here, guys. OMG, look at that. That is a Johan Soxon Martin Cuda. Thank you, oh my God, thank you. Man, oh man, y'all know I love my Johans. Man, you didn't have to do that, but man, thank you. Oh, y'all, y'all get over there and subscribe to Old Dutch. Look at this. How often you get a Johan sent to you? Not very often, let me tell you. Look at that. Hey, let's guess what color this is. Let's see. I'm going to guess... Let's see, I got a white one, I got an orange one. Let's say this one's going to be red. Let's just say red. You never know with Johan what color you're going to get. Ha <laughs> ha! Orange, alright. Look at there, guys. Hey, might as well just show you all what I got going on in the box here. Let's just get this thing opened up and see what's in there. Excuse me while I open this up, because we're opening this all up at the same time, guys. Let's get this out of the bag. Whoever packaged it, Dutch, you packaged it. You did a good job. Here is the instructions. A little bit yellow. Oh, it's even got the decal still. A lot of times you get old kits and they don't have the decals or they look like crap. That's really not in bad shape. It's got a little spot right there, but man... I could probably make those work. And they look really good. See the back. Oh, yeah. Thank you again. Oh, my gosh. Very simple instructions. There's the engine. Looks like a Hemi. Yep. Man, I can't thank you enough, Dutch. Let's check this out. I tell you what, I don't do a lot of unboxings, but I tell you what, Dutch does. Get over there and check him out. You want to see some unboxings on some kits? He does a lot of great unboxings. Oh, man. that You're too generous, brother. Thank you very much. I really, really appreciate it. And then, then right here, look, we got the glass, which we're not going to pull that out. Looks like the glass is it there. Let's see. Oh, yeah. We got the, the chrome tree, the red parts, clear parts. Look at those valve covers. Look at that. Y'all see that those valve covers right there? You got two plugs per cylinder. Look at that. Boy, that's going to be fun to wire up. But I can do it. If anybody can do it, I can do it. There's some loose parts laying around in there. It's 
got the good old keystones with it. Oh yeah, the tires, look at that. Oh yes. There is the hood, the scoop. It's even got the hood pins in it. Firewall, radiator support, radiator, fan, hoses, master cylinder. Uh, it's a wheel back. There's the the dash. Looks pretty good. Let's get some of these parts out of here. Oh, we got here. We got we got the headers, the rear end. Looks like a part of the frame member thing there. Leaf springs, fuel cell. Heck yeah. Man, all these parts are pretty much still on the trees too. Look at this. Dutch, man, thank you, brother. It's got a little bit of flash, but hey, that's all right. Look at that. It's got two distributors. Like I said, you got two plugs per cylinder. Man, look at that. There's really not that much flash. That ain't too bad. Eh. Nah. I seen more flash and flash dancing, man. We got a couple of loose parts in there. Let's take a look at this chassis. There is the chassis, and you know, for Johan to actually have the 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 rear end and stuff you do yourself that's that's pretty rare yeah johan's usually just a chassis plate and that's it so that's pretty nice let's see here is the interior tub back seat delete correct oh yeah so you're gonna make into a great socks and martin look at that body that body's pretty crisp look at that says remove that piece right there let's look at this front oh yeah man look at that great great body that thing's sexy look at that rear end oh yeah don't get me started on the rear end oh yeah oh different video okay there she is guys like I said, thank you so much, Dutch. That is an awesome gift. Thank you, man. I really appreciate it. Uh, Y'all get over there and check him out. Check out Doug. Check out Rick. Check out John. They'll all be in the description. And Stephen Baker. He sent me that 57. That's going to be my next project. So, All right. And I do have a final on the uh, 60, 60 uh, AMT... Uh, ford falcon annual and i'll get that out sometime this week as well and uh yeah thank you guys um hope y'all had a merry christmas and hopefully you'll have a great new year love you bye